This segment of Panther Sports Talk is brought to you by CFU, the power of service. The Panther men's track and field program will travel across the country in the month of February as they prepare for the Missouri Valley Conference Indoor Championships. It will be held in the Unidome February 24th and 25th. We caught up with head coach Dave Paulson for a look at this diverse group of student athletes. The men's track and field team is coming off its highest finish in eight years as they took second place at last year's MVC Outdoor Championships. But they have to replace Brandon Carnes, the conference record holder in the 60 and 200. And they'll look to some newcomers in the short sprints and hurdles to do so. We have freshman Isaiah Trousel. He's one of the most decorated uh, track athletes in the history of the state of Iowa. And so he's looking to kind of pick up uh, a little bit there in the 60 meter dash along with a couple other young guys that we have that just uh, getting in there. And so we're, we're really young in the short sprint side of things. Uh, but the talent is there, we just got to get it pieced together. We have a, a veteran group of hurdlers still uh, this year with uh, Connor Ham and Cole Phillips. Uh, they've both been in the conference finals the last couple years uh, and they've, they've been looking really strong and looking for a, a push to make maybe make it up into that top three all-conference type uh, ranking. UNI has depth and experience in their long sprints with versatility to go between 200s and 800s. We have some veterans there with Corey Hertz, who was all-conference outdoors last year, Evan Long, uh, Jacob Smith, who runs the 400 hurdles outdoors, was all-conference. He, he doubles back indoors and runs the 400. And you have a couple of young guys in there, Sven Vandenberg, who is a freshman from Belgium. He's run 47-1 uh, when he was over in Europe in, in high school, and so we're looking for him to have a big impact, as well as Connor Blau, a freshman from Dyke New Hartford. UNI also looks deep in the middle distance events. Uh, Jordan Pingle is kind of the, the leader of that group. Uh, he's, he's been in a conference final, I think, every, every final since his sophomore year. Uh, so he's back in the, in the action. Hunter LaValle, who was a freshman for us last year, who did a really good job, he's back. Uh, and Dylan Eigenberger, who's a redshirt senior for us this year. Uh, and all three of those guys look really good, as does freshman Seb Gearhart from uh, Cedar Falls. Four men competed at the NCAA West preliminaries in throws last year, and the expectations continue to raise with seven guys that could score at any meet this indoor season. Uh, Isaac Holtz, he, he's, a, he's a triple threat outdoors. He can do everything outdoors. Indoors, he does a really good job, shot put, weight throw. Uh, sophomore Keegan Tridel had a huge throw at our first meet in Iowa State. And Darius King, who's a redshirt freshman, he broke the freshman record in the first meet this year. And uh, then you have someone like Kyler Yotes, who, who's, who outdoors, uh, finished top five and Tom Music finished top five. And so it's, you know, we have all, all of those guys can score points in the shot put. And then you have a, a kid, William Blazer from Western Dubuque, who's a freshman, uh, who threw 66 feet in high school. And uh, he's looking terrific too. 